Welcome to our channel, Ochareo. This video is about Ochun and her orishas, like Aye, Orisaye, and others. How we may add the move to them, the characteristics that you to know how to work with them to improve your religious life. Starting with Aye. Aye is the oricha that confirm the wealth of Ochun in the earth. This oricha you has one ota, five cobo shells. You add five silver dollars. And some people in our religion put her nest to the counting machine. It's important to know that this oricha eat uh, two hens and also pigeons. But when we receive a year, we are supposed to feed also. We go to the forest, for example, we open the hole, and then in the hole you add a ku, a ya, and a wado. The person is supposed to be clean with one pigeon, and then you feed also, and also feed the hole. When you finish, you put the pigeon inside the hole, and then you throw the coconut to know, to know is everything a board, and then you close the hole, you light a candle and you take Osu to the house. This is the richer that is important for Ochu. But sometimes you even can put her nest to Ochu and feed them together, but just fail. But if you don't want to do that, you can also offer a place with different patrons to both of them to help you in any single economic problem that you have. When we talk about Orisa Aye, Orisa Aye is the richer that it brings the stability in the relationship. Just one Ota, it has five Ibos shells. And also, this had the guardian, that the guardian live in the little uh, clay jar, like the Orichaoko one, but in the barrel, we need to paint the Osun of Ochun and prepare for this Orisha the herbs, the sweet herbs that we're going to make the machuquillo, like for example, amendra, a basil, a menta, a canistel, and others that make it sweet. And then, in addition to that, Orisaya leaf in the clay container, like the one that we have, for example, for the river, it is there. This container is supposed to be painted in yellow, but the cover we paint in green, and we make lines in yellow, like could be five of them, for example. And when we have some situation in the relationship or something like that, we can put this oricha next to Ochun and pray for it I put some at the moon. You throw the coconut and ask what at the moon or is I wants to confirm the relationship that you have. When we talk about Aye Chalunga, Aye Chalunga has one hand or chance, but also we need to wash 18 coins, but the half face. This oricha is the one that may plan about the economics and also organize all of that. is one of the paths of Obatala. He lives sometimes with next to Obatala, and sometimes you can put next to Ochun. He had just four little, little white stones and live in the cones, in with this oricha leaf. Also, Aye Chalunga is the oricha that brings us the opportunity to improve our life because it's the rich that brings with him a lot of ideas to our life. That's why it's important to receive Aye Chalunga if you model in Ocha is Ochun or you have crown Ochun, for example. This is one of the rich that goes to help you too. When we talk about the Ibejis, the Ibejis were born in the Odum or Chebara, like in the Untu. And it's important for the Ochun kids because it help and keep you free of traps and problems. When we have any situation in life, we can offer them some patrons 
and then you put it on top of the plate and every single day you're going to take some of them and you're going to clean in front of the bay and you go to pray that keep you free of traps in the street and you can make a promise I want everything be good for you that you can make a party for them don't have to be a huge party you just can call some kids make a, a party for them a cake a ice cream all of that and also you put the apron with you and then allow them to clean their hands in that apron because in that way you are showing the eBay that you respect them and you are serving them. When we talk about Ideon, Ideon is the warrior that always defend Ochun. So for Ideon, when we have problem, we can prepare three bowls of Nyan or Picadillo whatever you want and then inside put some stick of needles for example different needles and then the next day you clean in front of it the own but when you going to discard this boat try to discard in the house that is abandoned in the house that no one this in there that is in ruin this is important for you because in that case it that it the own bring the ire for you and eliminate all the enemies that you have in the street. Ilan and Chun, they had the relationship and from that relation, they had the song that the name was Logun Abde. Because of that, you see that so many kids of Ochun, the fire in Ocha is England. When we want to offer something for England to solve any problem that we have, we can put him next to Ochun. And in front of both of them, you cook a fish and you put the plate with the fish and in, in the bottom put some orange. Some orange and also different fruit. Cut different fruits and offer it to them. Light your candles. Overall, if you have any situation with your health, because Inle, you know that is the doctor. He's the boss of the doctor. So it's important to pray to him if we have any single problem with our health. Agayusola. Agayusola is the origin that is the king of Ochun. In all, the Odun of Barasa, he authorized Ochun that his kid could be crowned through her. That's why we know Alaguas in our religion that has crowned Ochun Oro to Agayu. Also Agayu in so many cases is the father of the child of Ochun. And when we go to receive Agayu or do a ceremony with him, we need to go to the river and do ceremony next to the river to reflect his tool. And what happened that when we have some serious problems in life, we can feed Agayu and Ochun together. We give them the castrated gold and then we put them together but we feed a guy with his fur, with his uh, chicken, for example, with his pigeon, and all of that. And Ochun with her hands, pigeons, and the guinea hen. And then we cook these attaches separately. But we put them one to each other. When we do that, uh, after the three days that we light the two candles, we take these attaches. The attaches of a guy go to the source of the river and we leave their achesses over there and then the achesses of Ochun you put inside the river and you you know a honey and all of that in this way you will, you can get anything that you want in life but this uh, kind of aura a boat uh, what we can call in different way is important that you do when you really really want to accomplish something in your life. Orumila. Orula, the apetebida he prefers is Ochun. And he had with her the daughter that the name was Poroye. And then the kids of Ochun they are supposed to receive the Awofaka or Ikofa of Orumila because they had a great relationship. Even we have in our religion the past of Ochun Ololo D that she works was Urumila 
and we need to put here, for example, the table of Ifa, also the Eleke of Ifa, the Apple, and all of that. And she live in the container. So it's important if you have crown or two or if you mind that you have orumina. Those orichas are important to you because all of them they create the ring of energy that Otun she can work with them. So after you receive the orichas that you have in your ita, little by little start to receive all of them and you will see how your life change for better. Thank you all of you to join us. Here you are, another video about Ochun Ibu Yumu to improve your knowledge about this beautiful origin. Leave your comment below about what of these origins of Adibu you have already and how they work in your life. A like, subscribe to the channel to receive notifications about new videos, live stream music, and interviews. Health, faith, and prosperity. That's what Oh, chaleo.